So they're happy to be home, but they were still panicked last night. Oh, lots of tears yesterday. Yes, lots of tears. Christina Acri evacuated from her home mid Sunday afternoon as ordered by the El Paso County Sheriff's Department about 330. Yeah, after the call came the scramble. Everything was going through my mind and, and it was, you know, a few pictures and some financial papers and a suitcase. She's one of the many residents living along Highway 115 in Little Turkey Creek Road who was under mandatory evacuation orders. Their homes just a short distance from the blaze. It was scary. We ran around like crazy, pulling things off shelves and packing up a little suitcase and not really knowing if we were taking the right things or the important things, but just getting out in time. Others also deciding which personal items to take with them. Clothes, food, water, records. And of course, their animals. Yeah, we got Smuckers, Marley and Roscoe, two dogs and a pig in the back of the truck. Some residents who live here say they can't relax as long as another evacuation looms, but returning home this morning was a godsend. I have never been so happy to get home in my whole entire life. It was amazing. It was great to see see that it's all in, all intact and we're so grateful to everybody who's fighting the fire and and taking care of us. The area along Highway 115 had 35 homes evacuated and those evacuation orders were lifted at 825 this morning. They say that many residents say they're so thankful for the crews battling the blaze. Reporting live off of Highway 115, Kerr John Bianca, Carido News Channel 13. Mm.